The Natural Oil and Gas Suppliers Association of Nigeria, NOGASA, says scarcity and high price of premium motor spirit, PMS, are caused by many challenges, especially the high price of automotive gas oil, AGO. The association said the AGO, commonly called diesel, was a major cause of unavailability of PMS because diesel was being purchased by transporters of PMS at a high cost to fill their trucks without profit. Mr. Bennett Corey, the national president of the association, made this known in Abuja while addressing newsmen. Corey said the marketers were not happy selling above 200 naira per litre because of the high cost of getting fuel to the station, but had no choice because it was the only way that could assist Nigerians to ensure product availability. The major cost is that diesel. Yes. Diesel is the cost of that scarcity, high price of PMS because you use HU to carry the PMS and all the products. The ship, I mean the vessel that brings those vessels, that brings those products to carry diesel too. You use diesel too to operate that depot. You use diesel too to operate the filling stations. The same thing brings the whole problem to that product that is high. So the, the, the listen is very clear. I've said it before. Until you fix the diesel. If you bring diesel down to 170 the way it used to be before, it, listen, okay, who will sell PMS for you at uh, 100 naira? Somebody will sell for you at 100 naira, who will sell the uh, petrol for you 90 naira because the diesel is cheap. That's what you use in piloting it. So if you want to do subsidy, you go and do subsidy on HU, not PMS, if you ask me. On the persistence, scarcity, and queues experienced in Abuja and environs, Corey said it was caused by bad roads, which was another serious challenge that hampered trucks from distributing products. Road is the major problem. From Port Harcourt to Abuja. Let me use Abuja where we are today. You cannot run one kilometer without meeting big potholes. Have you sat down and asked how much the marketers are losing? The filling station owners, the, the transporters, how much they are losing? every day on this bad road. More than 50 tankers every day, and these are products for people. Who will pay? You say insurance. How many insurance in Nigeria that can afford to pay for petroleum product losses? So, this, so all these things are problems. So if you can fix the road, it will help also. 70% of the problem, the delay of getting this product to stations, are roads.